think we're excited about the challenges that face us. I mean, certainly, you know, I always believe as seniors go, so go your team. So there's going to be a lot on Becca and Jazz Hines to lead the team and kind of will them to victory. I mean, that's kind of what what happens. Um, we had some freshmen that were very instrumental for us, and Ariel and Tori both, and they're going to have to step up as well. And I think they've had a great off season. Um, and then our freshmen, you know, they had to come in here and um, make some waves and have done a really good job in terms of uh, understanding what we're trying to accomplish. All three of the freshmen have a very high basketball IQ, so that's a very positive thing. Um, now it's just about being able to play at the pace in which you need to compete at the highest level. It was awesome. I think um, winning the Big Ten, you know, you're really proud of it. and really excited for the team but just to have that um, confirmed and have that hardware is just like you know it's there for life to remind you it's just awesome of, of what your team accomplished. Oh my goodness I'm obsessed with those rings it was really um, it, it just showed us that hard work whatever you do with hard work it's gonna you're gonna do the rewards like you're gonna get rewards from it. Well, that was exciting, and you know, I think uh, to win two Big Ten, Big Ten titles in the last four years is pretty special. It's something we're excited about. But you know, to me, as we were walking off the field, the you know half the team that I was standing next to was like, "Let's go win another one," you know. So they are fired up about the challenges ahead and are excited about the addition of Maryland and Rutgers to the league and the challenges that that faces as well. So, um, you know, we're, we're ready and it was a fun night for us, but it's time to put that in the past and worry about this year. And I think we had a good practice to start that set the tone.